And in Tech Time with me, Andrew Humphrey, you know we're nearing the finish line of the 2018 Olympic Games with the final events and medal ceremonies this weekend. This year took home the gold for the most high-tech Olympics ever. So difficult. Oh! Olympic athletes have been honing their ability to spin and jump off the mountain using high-tech simulators. Striver created the virtual simulation of the exact downhill course that the ski team is going to compete on in the Olympics. A step up from the Nordic track, athletes can also get an edge with the ski tech sports simulators, which can mimic a variety of snow conditions and terrain. Ski jumpers practice their technique using a wind tunnel by Darko Technologies. Six turbines blow up to 60 miles an hour so skiers can mimic the free fall of a jump without risking Three, injury. Two, one. Technology has made a show throughout the games. Intel kicking things off with a record-breaking performance, programming more than 1,200 drones in unison to take the Olympic rings sky high. Opening ceremony jackets by Ralph Lauren featured Toasty Tech, integrated heat panels that could be the future of winter gear. It is ink printed on there electronically that is conductive and creates the heat. And if you couldn't make it to watch the Olympic Games in person, there's still time to feel like you're there. The NBC Sport VR app features more than 50 hours of live virtual reality content this year, getting a little closer to the gold during the final stretch of the Olympic Games. Absolutely astounding. Now the NBC Sports VR app is free to download for both iOS and Android devices. It's also uh, compatible with a number of virtual reality headsets, including Samsung's Gear, Google Daystream, and Windows Mixed Reality headsets. If you don't have a headset, you can still check out 360 degree videos through the same app. So download it now. Absolutely astounding.